In the world today, there are billions of people. They come in all shapes, sizes, and colors. Some are old, some are young, and all of them are completely unique. While we're all different in our own ways, sometimes there are people that have us taking a second look. Here are 10 people you won't believe exist. Before we introduce these unbelievable individuals, be sure to click that red subscribe button. Paul Carrison. After a bad case of dermatitis on his face, Paul Carrison decided to try something radical. He applied a homemade silver compound to his skin for more than a decade. However, the prolonged exposure to the chemical compound caused Carrison to develop argyria. This condition causes the skin to turn a bluish gray color and can be permanent. He appeared on the NBC News Today back in 2008. He lived a rather secluded life prior to the interview due to his skin color as people had given him names like Papa Smurf. He passed away in September 2013 after suffering from a heart attack and severe stroke. Jose Mestri When he was 14 years old, Jose Mestri began to develop a tumor on his lip. Over the years, the tumor grew until it overtook the Portuguese man's face. Mestri says he did not receive treatment for a variety of reasons, including lack of finances and religious beliefs. Eventually, it had grown so large that he lost vision in one eye. He also began to have difficulty breathing and eating. In 2010, Mestri finally agreed to undergo surgery to remove the mask. The tumor that was removed weighed nearly 12 pounds. He required three additional surgeries to reconstruct his face. Today, he is tumor-free and ventures outside as often as possible. Michele Ruffinelli When she was younger, Michele Ruffinelli was an average-sized woman, but that all changed as she entered her 20s. After four children, the LA woman's hips ballooned. She grew to 420 pounds with the majority of the weight gathering at her hips. She currently holds the record for having the largest hips and bottom in the world. Her behind measures eight feet around. She does admit, however, that some everyday tasks can be difficult, like fitting into her shower. She also receives negative attention when she ventures out due to her figure. Despite the negativity, she insists that she's healthy and that's all that matters. Michelle Kopke. While Mikhail Ruffinelli has the largest hips, German model Michelle Kopke has the smallest waist. After waist training with corsets for three years, Michelle achieved her goal of a teeny tiny middle. Her slim hourglass shape wasn't easy to achieve. She wears her corset nearly 24 hours a day. In addition to waist training, she also swam and dieted. The end result was a 16 inch waist. However, there are some health concerns regarding her passion. She does have some muscle atrophy around her core due to the training. Despite the possible risks, Michelle is determined to continue her training in order to achieve a 15-inch waist. Carlos Rodriguez Also known as Haffy, Carlos Rodriguez became internet famous when his mugshot first went viral in 2010. It wasn't his crime that made him famous, though. It was his appearance. When he was 14, Rodriguez was in an accident. He'd been driving while on drugs and crashed, causing him to fly through the windshield. His head was flattened and he lost a portion of his brain, but he survived. His head, however, retained the flattened appearance, causing many to do a double take and cry, Photoshop! A new mugshot surfaced in late 2016 after he was arrested for attempted murder after setting a mattress on fire. Wim Hof. Wim Hof is a Dutch daredevil turned guru known for his ability to withstand extreme cold. The Iceman, as he's called, holds 26 world records related to his talent, such as longest ice bath. He claims that he can turn up his body's thermostat using special breathing exercises. Using this technique, he has climbed part of Mount Everest and completed a full marathon above the Arctic Circle in nothing but his shorts and shoes. In January 2012, he appeared in an episode of Fact or Faked Paranormal Files to prove his method. His opponent lasted 20 minutes in an ice bath and emerged with his body temperature lowered. Hoff remained in the water for over 90 minutes and there was no change to his core temperature. Billy Owen Prior to February 2009, Billy Owen was a motorcycle mechanic. Around that time, he began to experience frequent headaches and had trouble breathing through his right nostril. His doctor diagnosed him with sinusitis, but his wife pushed him to see a specialist. It was then that he discovered that he had a very rare form of cancer. In order to save his life, doctors removed his right eye and a good portion of his face. He now has a large hole where his eye used to be and he removes a dental plate in his mouth and he can stick his fingers through the hole. He uses his newfound talent to play a zombie in music videos and haunted houses. He was also featured in an episode of Freak Show, a reality TV show on AMC. Didier Montalvo 
Many of us are born with moles, birthmarks, or other natural markings, but sometimes nature goes a little too far. This was the case for little Didier Montalvo in Colombia. He was born with a condition known as congenital melanocytic nevus. This caused a mole on his back to become so large it covered his entire back, resembling a turtle shell. The villagers in his town believed he was cursed, so they avoided him and wouldn't allow him to go to school. When he was six years old, his story became public and donations began pouring in to pay for its removal. He was sent to England where doctors removed the massive mole. He now leads a normal life free of pain and physical limitations. Amu Haji. In Farash Band Iran, an 80-year-old man lives in a small brick hut near the village of Dezga. He lives a solitary life, partially by choice and partially because of his appearance. Amu Haji hasn't bathed for more than 60 years. He's dirty by choice, not because he doesn't have the means to clean himself. He says that being clean brings sickness, so he refuses to bathe. His face and beard are covered in soot from his pipe. Though his extreme lifestyle is confusing to some, Amu enjoys it and suffers no ill effects. Slamet. In 1991, Slamet from East Java in Indonesia had a tumor removed from his waist. He thought that would be the end of it, but then he began to develop benign growths all over his body. He was soon covered in hundreds of tumors. He was in constant pain. Doctors believe that Slamet was suffering from neurofibromatosis. This is a genetic condition which causes growths along the nerves. The growths began to form around his eyes and in his nostrils, making it difficult for him to see or breathe. In 2014, Slamet began a Facebook campaign in order to raise money to have the tumors to be removed before they robbed him of his sight. Want to see more unbelievable people? We have plenty! Why not check out some of our other videos, like 10 oldest people you won't believe are still living? And while you're here, why not leave us a comment? And hey, thanks and bye bye